Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Zach and we're doing another Ecomi Omi V video. Currently the price is 7182. Let me get the thing up for you. On a lower 6612 and a higher 7337. That's quite a lot of range, but in today's video, well, in this video specifically, I want to go over, because I saw that Vel had posted uh, some proof on Twitter last night, and I knew straight away that he was going to make a video about it. So I wanted to go over what his take was with these uh, NFT drops botting, or being botted, right? The Disney Gold Moments one. Uh, they he, he seemingly showed a lot of proof. I didn't quite get all of it straight away, mainly because I was too tired to even look at it properly, because... Uh, you know, he does a lot of this stuff quite late for me, which is all good. Uh, either way, I want to have a look at what he's talking about and give my own take. Yo, what is going on? And obviously, make sure to subscribe to him if you haven't already. But I'm pretty, pretty sure pretty much everyone who watches me must watch Val too. Well, I'm Cavill Anderson, and we are back with another VV and Ecomi video. And this is another video where we have to touch on some of the downsides of the community and some of the things that the team struggles with. But yeah, it has to be addressed because this is actually big and it's impacting every single person on the platform. Okay, so as as one of Cavell's very long term friends, i.e. six, seven ish years, even when he when he talks like this, you know, you know how you, like you know your friend's tones and voices and stuff? Even his tone of voice, I'm like, oh gosh, something's actually happening. Right now, and it's also impacting the image of um Ecomi, Vivi, and the platform as a whole, because it looks really, really bad. So um, before we jump into it, I do want to say, yo, I apologize to anyone who has tried to join the private group in the description. As you can see, the, the page is disabled for the moment because basically we grew so fast that the, the platform could not handle that at, th at this point in time. So now we have to switch to a completely different platform because, yeah, yeah, like we're running out of space over there because, yeah, what we were supposed to be doing in like two months happened in like two weeks. So, yeah, that being said, I mean, the group will be back up soon. <laughs> not not an ecomi soon like a really soon but i mean my great my, my migration is happening a lot faster than ecomi's probably but I, i'm just saying but um yeah so i just wanted to give you all an update on that if you have tried to sign up to the group this is why you have not been able to the group has grown very very fast so um that being said be sure to drop a thumbs up on the video subscribe to the channel if you're new and turn on notifications so you stay updated with everything going on and yeah let's jump into this so there is proof once again of botting and there is a lot of proof um, there went from being a time in the community where there's not proof, people were just speculating, people were just calling out people who had no collectibles and stuff like that. Now we are starting to get real proof. The community knows what proof looks like and people are pulling up with the proof now, which I absolutely love. So shout out to everybody who gets the proof. Always send me the proof if you can, because I, I this is how it is. I am always open to, to being honest and letting everybody know what is going on if you can prove that this is actually going on. So. This, you're gonna see a lot of uh, you're gonna see a ton of disturbing stuff here in this video, man. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> Some people might be real pissed off. I'm happy because that was my friend getting paid, but this man ain't said nothing for the first advert. <laughs> I love him. Uh, um, so especially if you didn't secure a lot of drops this weekend. So that being said, let's just jump straight into it. Check this out. So as you can see here, this is a little group, um, VV Trades. This is a VV Trades group, and. They're talking about what they're selling. They're selling a Disney. This guy, Ultra Booster, he's selling, uh, he's selling, look, 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 look at all the statues he's selling. I said, look, look, look. <laughs> Yo, he, look at all the sat statues he's selling. Up. Look at this. He got 70. Look, look at this mint number. He got 70. 877. So what we see right here, of course, it seems like it's a marketplace, if you like, for VB traders One, as the, three, uh, two, three, two, as the like, title the thing where it says there. Uh, and then we're seeing all the different editions, essentially, of uh, the Disney Walt uh, statue. Numbers he got. Look at Mickey all Mouse. the good mint numbers he got right here. People would people just want one of these. Like this is this is all stuff that an actual legitimate user cannot get anymore because he's out here doing this. Do you see this? And look at this charging a, a price price points between it. They got whole escrows and everything set up. If you don't know what escrows is, it's basically like a middleman middleman for the money, basically. Um, so, so people can be sure that they, they get it. Like it's the middleman. Like you hold the money, you hold this and then we, you swap it and give it to each other type thing. So yeah, it's just, it's just a way for people to verify that, that you're really going to get what you're um, being promised. Um, but yeah, as you can see that right there, look at this one, it's even more dope mints, but, but I mean, honestly, it's not even about the mint. These floors is going up crazy right now. Like literally getting any one of these would have been super valuable and it would have been huge and it could be life-changing to some people but then you got these 
guys out well, here doing this and getting like you know each win if they're selling for what 2k ish or whatever that's two four six eight ten twelve fourteen thousand dollars and we know it's worth more than that a lot of the time as well six, six seven and eight of them a piece like between these two guys that's one two three four five six seven eight nine Wow, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. That's ridiculous. Even if you were to sell them each for 1,500, right, which is less than what they're talking about, 22 times that, let's have a look real quick, 22 times, that's a minimum of 33,000, jeez, that's, that's not good. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, bro, like that, 23, 23 between two people, 23 between two people right now. That just took 20 people out of the equation. 20 plus people just got taken out of the equation right there. Look at this. <clears throat> so as you can see, more people out here flipping them. This guy got a few right here. Like, look at this. You So you can see this is a whole group full of people using these bots coming together and out here trying to sell this stuff. Here goes another one here. Another one here with one, four. So look at this. And then look at the mint numbers. So as you can see, this is a whole group of these guys doing this. Hold on. It, it continues. It keeps going. It definitely keeps going. I have four. He says, I have four. Look at this guy. He's happy because he got four of them. Then we have another one here. Check it out. <clears throat> How have they secured so you them? This? Like, are, are you seeing all this proof and all this evidence of people getting them? Well, technically, they're just saying that they out here cheating like this. Um, let, let's, let's go. Like, like, speaking of the proof. Speaking of the proof, let's go. Check this check this out, y'all. It's gonna get disturbing. Like, be warned. Look at this. As you can see, it's auto-clicking the buy button. Notice he all he has to do is click and get rid of the error. And it's uh, auto-clicking the button. I saw this, I didn't really get it, but now okay. Like I button see. for him. It's auto-clicking the buy button and it's it's constantly reserving. It's constantly reserving. It's auto clicking the buy button and constantly reserving for him. Look at that. He has one order. Look at that. He hasn't even been paying attention to these phones. He hasn't even, he, he hasn't had to pay attention to these phones. Look at this. He's literally clicking one button and it's auto clicking right now. It's, it's auto, it's auto, it auto finds the buy button. From my understanding, it auto finds the buy button wherever it is on your screen. So just moving, moving it around. This is why this is why we need capture. This is this is why people have been saying that we need capture. This is why they've been saying that we need some way of, you know, some like and, and th this this is unacceptable to be completely honest with you. This is absolutely unacceptable because this is one of the biggest drops that will ever hit VV, if not the biggest drop that could ever hit VV. I mean, I don't know. It's a debate. Is Disney and Pokemon like if if we get Pokemon in the future, would that be a bigger moment than Disney, or does Disney still have a piece of proof we have here? Look at this. And it's more. It's more video content as well. I have a longer video here for you all. Like right after this one, there's a longer video of proof. So check this out. This one was on 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 Twitter. This was going to viral on Twitter. Like look at this. Everything countdown together. Didn't put his hand on nothing. What? Automatically found the buy button and it clicked. It automatically found the buy button and clicked. As you can see, look at that. Just bought three. Just secured three just like that. Secured three just like that, yo. Are you kidding me? So This is embarrassing. Th this is what this is what's happening with these drops. If you're wondering why you cannot secure any collectibles, this is why you cannot secure collectibles. You have these people every single drop out here doing this. And then like we already saw that two people alone was able able to now get <clears throat> Val's saying that because he's in the moment of it, and realistically, these people are in some capacity, at the very least, responsible for people missing out drops. You know, for every NFT that is being botted, someone else is losing out on it. So it might not be the entire drop, but it's still a sizable enough amount where this is actually really bad. Like, it's... I don't know what the numbers are, but either way, like this happening, it shouldn't be happening. I'm going to go for more of my thoughts while I continue with those first. Get over 20. Two people by themselves get over 20. This group have hundreds of people in it. This group has hundreds. It has hundreds of people in this group and two people alone is grabbing 20. So literally, I wouldn't be surprised if, if at least 500 of these went to people using bots. At least. 
That's the least. I wouldn't be surprised if over a thousand did, depending on how many of these guys are botting. But this this is crazy. This is crazy. Check this out. But it's even more. Yes, it continues. No copyrighted music. Maybe not. Not interested. It continues to be more. Check this out. All right, we're gonna check this out. He even he's gonna describe what's going on here. So look at this. BV bot for sale. DM. He, he this man is out here promoting the bot, and then he's gonna show that it's actually working. My man's just promoting the bot, and then he's gonna show proof. Hey man, so here's my idea. Here's Dragon Girl. So if you click on it, the script goes to buy right away. It looks for a buy button. So when the counter hits zero on a drop, it does the same thing. You have it instantly. You're still fighting with the other people. So if there's 20,000 NFTs and there's 600,000 people trying to get it, you have the edge with the bot because you don't have to press with your button and, you know, be too slow. You'll just be there and it's going to be reserving, you know, reserving the NFT. It doesn't mean it's always going to get it because when you're reserving, you know how it is, you're... The server can drop or there could be a problem um, like there was in the last days because it's overloaded. But, you know, this this is amazing. I should have bought this hat. My buddy bought it. I didn't buy it. So, I mean, if you look at this man's clicking skills, it's, it's obvious. It's obvious why he's using the bot right now. <laughs> but as you can see, this can be used on the secondary market. Just didn't do it like that, Mel. <laughs> People are doing this. You ever wonder why you can't get like you have to skip through the, to the middle and you can't get any of those ones that first pop up? This is why. Because you have like 10, 20 of these guys using one of these where all they got to do is press one button and these guys are going to go for it. And more than likely, one of them will get it because they don't even have to click the buy button. This is why you can't secure drops. This is why you can't secure things on the secondary market. This is this is this is what's going on within VV right now, and it's absolutely ridiculous. Look, at this. I can't send videos of bots working. The guy who sold me said not to show to anyone because he can have problems. After we have our group, we're like eighteen people, and we trade there. So look at this. Here are my here are my drops from yesterday. That's his drops from yesterday, yo. So these are his drops from yesterday, and if you look in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nine. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. My man's got damn near 20 by himself. He's got damn near 20 by himself. He just ran it up. So realistically, it's damn near worth it to just sit here and buy a bunch of, to buy a bot. Like this is what this is showing because people like him can come out here, do this and get this and make a quick come up. They, they can make a quick come up doing this right here. And like, are they ever truly going to be punished for it? No. Like, how do you like? Not because, <clears throat> not because this, he told me you don't want to, but how do they? It needs to be stopped because honestly, it's not even their fault for abusing bots because at this point, the only way you can combat something like this is to join them. Mm -hmm. Really, the only way you can combat something like this is to join them. Unless VV steps in and actually solves the problem which apparently is not getting done. And then you're doing the most historic drops in the history of the blockchain and you're not you're not making sure your 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 shit's together before you do them. You, the servers crashing for the first drops, you're not checking in with the, your partners, you're not preventing botting like like what are you doing? You just oh, we got the Disney license, let's just drop it. Like hands up, we we did it. Disney license. There y'all go, do something with it. And that, that's it. That's not where that's not where it ends. That's not where it's supposed to end. You're supposed to make sure this drop goes as smoothly as possible and on board to as many I people agree. as possible. And everyone who's on board actually Pardon gets me. a great experience and gets a fair shot at winning. And this is far from having a fair shot at winning. Now, honestly, I, I completely agree with what, with what Cavell is saying here. And I think this actually realistically, because everything else, like people talk about exchange and stuff, that's like a genuine when question, right? Um, that will be f sorted out once all the processes that need to be sorted out are sorted out with it. But when it comes to this, this is an actual real problem, and this is going to be a massive PR issue, uh, let alone customers just 
li literally leaving. This is not, this can't happen. This is actually probably Ecomi's biggest problem right now because the exchanges are going to happen. Immutable exit migration actually really quickly, we can go over that because it's happening. Um, I think, let me see if I can find it because I did like it on my Twitter account. So I'll, I'll find it for you now. Someone showed it was comics and crypto. Here we are. Comics and Crypto even showed that, you know, Immutable is being listed now within the VV app, right? This digital collectible will be linked. Whoops. I just was, um, uh, this digital collectible will be linked only to you. It is scarce and exclusive. VVs can sell, trade, etc. on the VV app platform and send it to other Immutable X wallets that are not connected to VV's platform. So the Immutable X thing is happening. Exchanges are happening. You know, it's just being worked through. The MTL is happening, etc. But bots and, uh, and that you know, the team have regularly said that it's not a big enough of an issue that for them to really do much about it, at least that's what I've heard. Maybe I'm wrong. Um, this is going to spread. The word's going to spread. People are going to stop trying. Simple as. People already have stopped trying. I know it because people have told me. People will stop trying. People have stopped trying. And this is probably the one thing that Phoebe, like you can we just need to get get together. Now, what do they do here? Well, KYC is potential. Captures, a lot of people have been saying that ruins the user experience. I think this ruins the user experience way more than captures would. If they have to, they have to. Captures wise. I think like especially when it comes to these sorts of drops that are as important as this, they should have implemented it. Um because this is just unacceptable as well, say, and it can't happen. With that said, um, I now see what's happened. So, because beforehand, like I said, I, I wasn't quite aware. Uh, now I'm aware, and uh, this isn't a good look. I'll say when things aren't a good look, when things aren't good, this is bad. So, Ecomi, hopefully, you know, hopefully this will be addressed. I think rather than words coming out from the team this time, I think we're going to have to see some actual actionable things taking place. The reality is the people who are botting. They're not going to be penalized for it. I doubt it. If they are, great. But to be honest with you, it's a system. That's what needs to be fixed. So captures for now until I figure something else out. Great. Like something needs to happen though. What are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments below. Of course, make sure to subscribe to Vale's channel. I honestly, I was hoping for it to be less concrete than this, but you can't really get much more. You know, with that being said, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below. If this video was interesting or helpful to you in any way, shape or form, or like or something appreciated. And if you would like to be kept happening in this topic every single day, most times a day, this is my channel. I cover everything on every single day. So if you want to be able to happening, hit that subscribe button and key notifications on. Have a great day, everyone. I'll see you in the next VV video.